Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Lumen Moon Tarot. So everybody, I am here doing a random collective reading. This reading is for the collective, so it may or may not resonate with you, okay? Just take what does resonate and toss out the rest. Um, don't try to force any reading into your world. And thank you, collective, so, so much for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations. Everything that you guys do that helps this channel keep growing. Thank you so, so much for all of your support. I truly mean that. All right, so what I'm seeing here is um, I'm seeing somebody who um, had a lot of options in the past, okay? Um, and I feel like they highly underestimated you. Um, they were under some kind of illusion or something. They couldn't see clearly your worth. And now they're seeing everything for what um, what it is, right? And they're seeing all of their options laid out before them and they're realizing that there's no other option like you, okay? Um, there's just no one like you. I feel like you're extremely intuitive here. You're sitting in the Empress throne. Um, you've been put through it. And I feel like this is a person who triggered you um, to go on this journey, okay? So whoever this is, whoever broke your heart, whoever treated you like an option, um, the person that really brought you to your knees to the point where you had to build yourself up from ground zero, okay? That person who triggered you um, to change your whole entire life. And I feel like um, now you're in this point of your life where you're, you've healed, at least, I mean, for the most part. There's always more healing to do. There's always more lessons to learn, right? Um, but you have come so far, Collective. Uh, sitting in the Empress Throne here, you're very independent. Your, your finances are abundant now, okay? Um, you could be a boss, business owner. You're basically somebody who um, is growing uh, an empire on your own, okay? Um, and you're celebrating here. You're, you could be going, um, getting invited out, going out with your friends, just celebrating the fact that you've changed your whole life around. You've put forth so much effort into everything that you've done. Um, this is a major time of celebration for you. And now this person, for uh, somehow they're seeing how abundant you are. They're seeing that you can manifest your own abundance here. You know, the Empress, um, number one, you're every queen in the deck. And number two, you sit on your throne and attract opportunities and blessings to you, basically. That's what you're doing here. You attract, and you're attracting abundance. And I, I feel like you're attracting other people, too. Um, but you, like I said, you're in a time of celebration right now. This person can see it. And now they want to come in and make you an offer here, but you're not talking to them they could have already tried to reach out to you, but you're not speaking to this person. And I feel like they realize now who you are and who you are to them and what you're all about. Um, I feel like it's taken this person way too long to come forward. And um, you're using your into You're just very intuitive here. And this person can see clearly now that you were the blessing. You were a blessing from the divine this whole time. Um, unconditional love, beautiful love there. And I feel like they're missing out because um, they're moving too slow. They're very sluggish energy, you know. Um, but they see you from a whole new perspective now. Um, they see you as a high priestess, empress and an ace of cups what is this yeah this person they had just stuck in their in your mind and now you're a star i feel like this is where they had you but this is your healing you healed from this they had you in a mental mind trap this is the person who triggered you on this journey and now you've healed you're beautiful you're gorgeous they didn't see this about you 
right? They did not see it. But I, I feel like it's your intuition too um, and the messages that you've been getting that have led you to heal from this situation. You're nowhere near where they left you, okay? Nowhere near where they left you. See, this is why they have a change of per, uh, um, seeing you from a new perspective, right? Because this is where they left you, like this, Tied up, unable to sit. No one came to get you out of this trap. No one gave you any truth or clarity. You were blindfolded here and stuck. And, and now you're a star. I mean, huge difference, right? So, yeah. This person sees you from a whole new perspective now. I feel like they're very emotional, too, as they hang here. You could be dealing with an earth sign, um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could be dealing with a Pisces. All right, what else can you show me? Yeah, now they want to come in and reunite. Now they see everything clearly, okay? Yeah, this is a, reunite, a, a reunion card, reunitement. Wanting to build something solid with you. They see you as their happiness now. Whereas before, you know, they stuck you with the rest of the options. Tucked you away. Covered you up with a sheet. <laughs> you know, they didn't, think, they didn't think you were worthy. But now you're, it's like you're eye popping, you know. Yeah, now they want you. Now they want you. Wheel of Fortune right um a cycle coming to an end here you're starting a whole new lifestyle Ooh, i'm sorry that was my bad yeah but they're watching you not knowing like they don't exactly know what you're doing with your life right now um i mean they can see you on a glow up they can see you becoming very successful and abundant but you're keeping your um, personal moves hidden. I feel like this person is like looking into you, um, trying to dig up things, any kind of information that they can find. They may not know if, if you have any feelings for them left because you're not speaking. You're focused on you. You got your back turned over here doing your healing, just living a peaceful life now. They may not know, um, you know, it, it, how you feel about them. But I feel like they're looking, they're watching, they're stalking you, trying to find any information that they can about you, but they can't. They're feeling very out in the cold. Um, this person could be having some financial issues, too. This is a lot of financial struggles. Being, uh, they, they could be homeless at this point for some of them, not for all of them. Um, in bad health. You know, this is having a lot of issues in life right now. And I feel like they're, they're just feeling like they're not even part of your world anymore. Do you know what I mean? And they're trying to manifest you back in. You could be dealing with a Virgo. I've got Taurus out here. Um, I've got Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, Earth signs. Yeah, now they're trying to manifest you back in. Yeah, because they're secretly in love with you here, and they know they need to apologize. Yeah, this person's trying to figure out a way to get back into your um, to your energy here so that they can apologize to you because um, they do have a lot of love for you here. They're, just know whatever you're posting out there, um, collective, any pictures, anything you're doing um, in the public eye, right? They're watching you. So I feel like you've been keeping your moves hidden. Keep doing that, you know, because you've got a you've got kind of a stalker here. This person wants to come in and apologize to you. They've been hiding how they feel. 
And this offer has taken way too long. All right, what else can you show me for the collective? You know, let's get what they have to say, actually. I want to pull some out of that. So, yeah, this person wants to come in and apologize now. And I feel like um, you're really not focused on them. You, I feel like you don't want to go back into that mental mind trap. You've healed from that. And right now, you're just celebrating your new life. That's what I'm seeing you do. You're just celebrating your new life. All right. What, what does this person want to say? Thank you. I smile when I remember how you wanted nothing to do with me when we first met. I feel like that's what you're saying. I feel like, um, yeah, they really, you know, they, they treated you like an option walked away, um, possibly just abandoned you, you know, and now I feel like you're smiling, you've changed your life, and now they're watching you, okay, sometimes I cry about you when I'm alone, when I said I didn't love you, that was a lie, I miss holding you and touching your skin, give me one more for the collective, this is going to be just a really quick check-in, guys, okay? Um, just a really quick energy check for you. But, yeah, that's where we are right now. You know, the one who treated you like an option now wants you back. Now that you're successful and you've healed, you know, I wonder if you're happy without me. That That's... I feel like they already know you're happy without them. They are searching and watching, though. What are you doing without them? Do you see what I'm saying? But you're keeping your moves hidden. See? I check on you every chance I get. This person's stalking you. Trying to figure out what's going on behind the scenes with you. Okay? Just so you know. Just You're being stalked. They're, they're trying to find out anything that they can about you, okay? Um, just keep your moves hidden, all right, collective? And just keep doing you. Just keep doing you. This person wants to come in and apologize. They're currently trying to manifest you back in somehow. Um, but, you know, until they can confront and tell you how they feel, I say just keep doing you. Because it's working for you, okay? Anyway, Collective, that's what I've got for this quick reading. Um, I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. If you like this video, please click that like button. Subscribe to my channel, right, if you like this um, vibe and this resonates with you. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.